Do you want to make this beautiful pattern with only one row? Let's get started. Start the work with a slip knot and then make a multiple of 14 chains plus 6. I made 48 chains totally. Now start my work. Skip 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 chains and make 1 double crochet into 6th chain from the hook. Then skip next two chains, one and two, and make a V stitch into this chain. One double crochet, one chain, and again one double crochet into same chain. Again, skip one and two chain, and go to next chain, make one V stitch, one double, one chain, and one double into same chain. Then make a chain and again another V stitch into the same chain. One double into the same chain, one chain, and another double into the same chain. Now I have two V stitches with one chain between them into the same chain. Again, skip next two chains and make one V stitch into the next chain double, one chain, and one double is a V-stitch. And now skip one and two chain and go to next three chains. I want to make one incomplete double crochet here and skip next chain and one incomplete double crochet into third chain, okay? Yarn over, insert dog into this chain, yarn over, pull up a loop, and yarn over, pull through two, Yarn over, skip next chain and go to the next and make another incomplete double crochet. Now I have three loops on the hook, yarn over and pull through all of them. Now skip one, two and go to next chain and make one V stitch here. One double, one chain and another double into same chain. Skip one and two chain and go to next chain and make one V stitch. One chain and another V stitch into same chain. Skip one and two and make one V stitch into next chain. Skip one and two, make one incomplete double crochet into next chain. Yarn over, skip next, and make one incomplete double crochet into the next. And yarn over, pull through all three loops on the hook. And then we have to repeat this work. Skip next two chain, make one V stitch. Again, skip next two chain, make one V stitch, one chain and one V stitch into the next. Skip the next two chain and make one V stitch and then skip next two chain and make this decrease stitch until the end. Now I'm at the end of row one. And after last V stitch, skip one and two chain and make one incomplete double crochet into next. Skip the next and make another incomplete into last chain and yarn over pull through these three loops and row one is finished. Now fasten off and cut the yarn because I want to start next row with another yarn. Now make a slip knot again with next yarn and turn the work and attach this yarn to last stitch of row one and start row two with three chains one two three and then make 
one double crochet into chain one space of first v-stitch here now go to next chain one space of next v-stitch and make one v-stitch into that one double one chain and another double into same chain one space and go to next chain one between these two V stitches and make one V stitch, one chain, and again one V stitch into same chain one space. And go to next chain one space of the second V stitch of these two V stitches and make one V stitch here. One double crochet, one chain, and one double crochet. Now, make one incomplete double crochet into next chain one space of next V stitch, yarn over, insert the hook, yarn over, and pull through two. Then skip this decrease stitch and go to next chain one space of next V stitch and make one incomplete double crochet into that again and yarn over, pull through these three loops. Okay? Then go to these two V stitches, first make one V stitch into chain one space of first V stitch then make one V stitch one chain and one V stitch into this chain one between these two V stitches one double one chain one double into same space make a chain and again one double one chain and one double into same space and make one V stitch into V stitch of uh, into chain one space of next V stitch. One double, one chain, and another double into same space. And repeat that work. Go to next chain one space, make one incomplete double crochet. Then skip next decrease stitch. Go to next chain one and make one incomplete double into that and yarn over, pull through these three loops and continue this work. We have to repeat this work and continue this sequence. Make one V-stitch into first chain one of first V-stitch, one V-stitch, one chain and one V-stitch into this chain one of between these two V-stitches and one V-stitch into chain one of the second V-stitch. Then make a decrease stitch over these two chain one spaces of these two V stitches and skip the middle decrease stitch and repeat that work until the end of the row. Now I'm at the end of row two. Make one incomplete double crochet into this chain one of last V stitch and then make one incomplete double crochet into this beginning decrease stitch and yarn over, pull through all loops. And row 2 is finished, fast enough, and cut the yarn and continue my work with another yarn. Make one slip knot and turn the work and attach the yarn to this first stitch. Start row 3 with 3 chains and repeat row 2. Make one double crochet into this chain one space of first V-stitch. Then make one V-stitch into the first chain one here of these two V-stitches. Then make one V-stitch, one chain and one V-stitch into this chain one between these two V-stitches here. And after that, make one V-stitch into chain one of second V-stitch. And 
make one decrease stitch over these two chain one spaces and skip this middle decrease stitch. One incomplete double crochet here and one incomplete double crochet here into next chain one space. And repeat that work. And at the end of row three, make one incomplete double crochet into last chain one and one incomplete into this beginning decrease stitch and collect them together. And then we have to repeat this row, row two or row three. This one row should be repeated several times until the height of the pattern reach the desired size. Now this is my pattern. After repeating that one row, the front view and the back view of the pattern are the same. I hope this video will be useful for you. If you like that, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video and leave a comment. Have a nice day.